On the landing gear struts, it's very important that the strut rod end move like so. To check yours, take your hand and grab the strut and turn it and the ball joint rod end has got to rotate within that stainless steel U-bracket at the top of the landing gear strut and at the bottom. It's also very important that this stainless steel U-bracket be able to turn. So you should be able to take your fingers and without much pressure at all, turn the stainless steel U-bracket like this. That prevents binding. So when you have a really bad landing, if you ever do, and your landing gear comes up high to uh, absorb the shock of the landing, this rod end needs to be able to pivot at both ends, top and bottom, and if it gets bound up, then the stainless steel U-bracket will turn, and that's going to save your landing gear and your airplane. Now, I've seen too many cases where this stainless steel bracket is very tight, and you cannot turn it. That's going to ruin your airplane. And I've also seen where these rod ends could not turn, and that is also going to ruin your plane. So pay very close attention to the rod ends and the stainless steel U-bracket to be sure that they can rotate top and bottom of the landing gear strut. 